So let's try and work out how each one of these different factors affect which treatment we're going to choose. The first and critical factor is your tumour itself. Now, how do you know what type of tumour you've got? Well, you know by the PSA level, by the Gleason score, by the extent of tumour, how many biopsies are positive, how many are negative, and by what we call the clinical stage, how extensive it feels on a finger examination. Let me give you some examples of how that might affect your choice. Low dose rate brachytherapy is only suitable for small Gleason 6 or 7 tumours. High dose rate brachytherapy is suitable for more aggressive tumours such as T3 tumours or where the PSA is over 10 or 15. Surgery is best for intermediate risk or low risk tumours and nerve sparing surgery is only suitable when the cancer is contained to the prostate. That means you can't have too bulky a tumour, particularly on the side where you're trying to spare the nerves. High intensity focused ultrasound, which is a new novel therapy, is only really suitable for Gleason 6 or 7 tumours and not the more aggressive tumours. Robotic surgery is only really suitable for the smaller cancers because the more aggressive cancers seem to end up giving you a higher positive margin rate, meaning that you've got a lower chance of cure. So that's how the tumour factors affect it.